Hey, how you guys doing? I hope you are fine. Thank you very much for clicking my YouTube channel. I'm a team Lisa. I'm back again with a new video. And today's video, guys, everybody, listen up, okay? Hey, including me? I said everybody, okay? Okay. <laughs> if you are a fresh graduate, if you are a student, I think this is going to be very, very important to you. Why? Because you, the message that I'm about to tell you is going to change your life. It's going to define the future for years to come. That's why I think you have to stay in a very quiet place and prepare your cup of tea. Uh, uh, sorry. What? I, I don't drink tea. Well, prepare your cup of coffee then. I don't drink coffee either. What the f***? You know what? You precisely just keep quiet, okay? Don't talk, all right? That's all that I want. Anyway, guys, stay tuned for that. It's going to be very, very important, okay? Okay, now from the title, you know exactly what I'm talking about. Don't go to school to get a job. Go to school in order to open your own business. Opening your own business has so many privileges, okay? But we will talk about that later on, okay? But now, First of all, in, in African art, in order to find a job, it is very difficult. It's not easy. Why? For so many factors, it's very difficult to find a job. First of all, there is a huge gap between the number of the fresh graduates and the number of the job availability. I mean, the number of the, of the, the, the job that uh, every year our government brings is very, very low comparing with the number of the fresh graduate or the graduate student. And so that's why it's very difficult to find a job on you after, after graduation. Unfortunately, because of the corruption, most of the job opportunities or most of the jobs not based on the merit. It's a based on connection basis. I mean, if you are, if you have a, your father's friends or your mother's friends or your relative's friends, they have a company and they know your father, they will hire you. That's how it works in, our, in many African countries. And so it is very, very difficult to find a job, right guys? And so that's why in order to, after graduation, all the time think to open your own business. This is very, very, it's a, it's a best way actually to do. Despite the fact that Africa has so many difficulties and obstacles, but also Africa is full of opportunities for people who actually want to have their own jobs. And so it's going to be better. You are struggling in the beginning. It's, it's not, it's not, it, it will never be easy. It's not going to be very easy and, and, and just smooth. In the, in the beginning, of course, you will f you know, face so many difficulties and obstacles because nobody will find, it's very hard to find, you know, um, uh, you are you're still fresh and you don't have experience and so. And that's why I recommend after graduation, I think you have to work for anyone for free. You don't have even to get a salary because if you, st if you go to any company and say, please hire me, they will tell you, well, we, we, we don't want to hire you, okay? Because you are fresh graduates. But if you tell them that I, I just want to work for free, I don't want anything from you, they will put that into consideration. Maybe they will hire you, okay? Think about it. Okay, that's it for today. Thank you very much for watching, guys. Until next time, I wish you health, wealth, and the peace of mind. Asante.